you've noticed I said something different at the beginning of this bad boy, it's because Bruin views are whack. Oh, that is whack. We decided, so we're gonna try to do this thing where we, it's like stomp, but I hate on the change. Table. How could you do that? We were desperate. It's like stomp, but on the table. What are they doing? What the hell are they doing? They're stomping the yard. Where are you from? Stop. You ain't never seen stomp. They're stomping the yard. Get your hands off me, dog. You're an idiot. Duh. They're stomping. <laughs> Shoot. But I've never seen stepping like this before. They had broomsticks or something. They were slopping around. I can't imagine that's true, but maybe. <laughs> yeah, broomsticks. That's how they make the beats. It's all. We'll see who walks away with the trophy and the money. Me, trophy in one arm, and your girl on the next. Yunk down and bounce. Yunk down and. Guys are weird. Anywho, do you guys probably want to know what the F we're doing? Changing up our Friday videos. We're going to review stuff from the grocery store, but we're a couple of drunks and alcoholics, and on Friday the weekend starts, so we drink. It's really just a concept. Instead of like watching a view, like a view portion, like instead of watching some instead YouTube of video, video, it's more of just us like detoxing from making videos and intoxing our throats with beer and old childhood favorites or like new stuff that's come out that's fun. It's um, kind of that grocery store realm. So you, you know? probably saw the thumbnail and you probably already get it in this long winded explanation is unnecessary. Necessary? Is it necessary for me to drink my own urine? Probably not. Dodgeball. There you go. Yeah. Okay. So what are we eating today? Dude, the ultimate classic, man. Are you kidding me? This was my go-to Lunchable when I was a wee child. This is everywhere. This is my go-to Lunchable that I would be like, dude, can I have one of those? Yeah. We obviously didn't buy dude, these in the Wagner household. they haven't changed household. this at all. Also, nutrition facts are a bummer to look at. Did your family actually get you these? Always. Really? Dude, my dad worked at a grocery store. So yeah, today we're having the pizza with pepperoni Lunchable and we're drinking New Belgium's Triple. I feel like this is fulfilling my childhood dream. I don't, I don't know if I've ever owned a lunchable. Oh, it's a sad, sad situation. And it's getting more and more. Do you think like little seven-year-old Corey thought that his life at 30 would be drinking really good craft beer and eating the same food that you couldn't get that you wanted then? Mind Dude. blow. When someone tries to blow you up, not because of who you are, but because of different reasons altogether. Um, I have not had one of these. I'm not kidding you since seventh or eighth grade. Yeah, so this is a big right? deal. I love that they didn't change Come this on. at all. I wonder if Lunchable's doing well. So they give you three of these unleavened breads. Oh. Um, a packet of a pizza sauce. Of I, just probably ten pepperonis. And then just a dab. Hello. Oh yeah, a little dab of Ruski cheese. Do we have to pay her as a producer now? Yeah. She wants one little Damn piece it. of cheese. One little cheese. Hey, Cindy, you ain't getting any in my cheese, dude. But here's the money move. You wanna know the money move? M squared? Yes, what's M squared? Since you, apparently, since you've never had these, you need to, yeah, well. You ever met anybody with pepperoni nipples? Sure, a couple girls, I, um, yep. <laughs> Not okay! The money move is the microwave. M money cubed. move is M squared. Is money move something Floyd Mayweather says? You <laughs> love money, right? I mean. <laughs> I mean, it's cool, it's cool. Yeah. Yo, that's know. a money move. And if you even, we probably owe him 50 grand now. Yes. We gonna build these bad boys? Let's do it. Uh, jump cut. Welcome so. to the build station, bitches. It's not a thing we're starting. The build station, the build zone. I like the, the idea of the of the words you said, but mm -hmm. the way you said it really angered me. Oh, with the bitches in Welcome there? Welcome to the bitches. Why do you guys subscribe to this channel? There's very little reason. <laughs> I think it must be out of self-hate. Okay, so when I was a kid, I wouldn't use a plate. I like it. I'm going to go with it. Also, oh. in what fantasy world do you live in where you thought the cheese would fall like a cartoon down on... Here's how I did it. Okay. You go sauce first. You got to. You okay. ever made a pizza, bro? Dude, I told you I was uh, not privy to this excellent meal. If your single mother as a child, like when you were a child, couldn't afford Lunchables, what did you eat? Bro, fish sticks all day, dog. I don't know what I like best about Gorton's crunchy fish sticks and fillets. What goes into them or what doesn't? Fish sticks are probably more expensive. Fish sticks, bro. Fish sticks ain't more expensive than nothing. Okay, so Sick. also when you grow up with blue collar families, like you sometimes you're you don't have a utensil to like spread the sauce on. So yeah, I, would use use a, I would use spread. a pepper. I would use a pepper. I feel like rich kids didn't have to worry about this. No, they had a little silver spoon that they used. <laughs> oh! Boom roasted! Did the subscribers go up? <laughs> no. Can't imagine. So you spread this around, okay. like so. I just do the center dollop and finger swirl. Oh, so you have like a under the cheese pepperoni then? Yeah, dude, like Gino's. No, I'm not gonna do it. That's a great idea, but that's not what I did as a kid, so I'm not gonna do it. See, I'm taking my cheese out of the compartment because I didn't throw it around like a cartoon character. <laughs> okay, just like when I was a kid though, same realization. Can I they your don't cheese? they don't give you enough cheese. I know, that's why I just asked for some of yours. I wanna eat this whole stack of pepperonis. Just as a one bite? Yeah. So each one normally got 
three. Okay. And if I remember correctly, there was always one left over. Are you so you were four. Yeah. You get a oh, I got exactly nine. So there were nine pepperonis. Yeah, dude. Dude, those look pretty good. Here, let me give you guys a close up. Yeah. Jump cut. I mean, just you saw what we did. We did Mine looks good. Sauce, cheese. So uh, you put them in the microwave for like pretty much like 30 seconds because they explode. This is a thing I was not aware of. The cheese move, man, the, or the microwave move, I mean. You can't touch my plate or use my plate, so. You mind if I use your plate? You can't use any of the plates in this home. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and use some, um, better take your pants, pants off. off. <laughs> microwave it on, come on, man. Man, you do good pepperoni placement, but you didn't do any under the cheese. Yeah, I'll probably regret that. How long? 30 seconds. Boom, let's do it to it. This beer's pretty average. Two, well, one. Did the train run your apartment over? Do you do that all the time? That or is that your first time? That was the coolest way I could think of doing that. Did you see that? Fuck about you or anything that you do. Don't give a fuck about you or anything that you do. Check that out. Sure, I have a drink. You wanna go back to the table? Do I ever jump cut? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This kinda of reminds me of the host though. It kinda of looks like a little Jesus cracker. Body of Christ? What if they handed you <laughs> Do you ever do the only mouth? Body of Christ. You did as a joke though, didn't you? I have not ever done it, but I, oh. that's like my dream. Like if someone makes me go up at a wedding, I'm just gonna mouth them, you know? I used to lose it when I I was an altar server and I'd sit, in the, I'd sit in the front row and then people go there and go, Father Don would be like, Body of Christ? <laughs> <They're all laughs> Dude, grab it with your old. hand, you weirdo! They're probably all old people who got that arthritis, they can't even, because it was always like people who were a thousand. That's so weird! So like, I can't, I grab it, I put it in my hands, but they're all crippled up. Ugh, I, it's so creepy to me. Take a look at that. Second angle, what? It's kind of like what we do in the car, but just like on a budget. That's right. We got pork, chicken, and beef. Oh God. Pasteurized prepared cheese product, pizza crust, and pizza sauce. My God. This is pizza with pepperoni Lunchables. Cheers. Oh yeah. Way worse than I remember. Really? It's not that great. <laughs> I mean, I didn't think it was gonna be good. I did, I had a memory of like, I think because I never got these, mm -hmm. I had a memory and would like seriously only have them like people would give them to me. Mm -hmm. I, did, I just, in my head, put it on a pedestal, you know? Presenting Lunchables Pizza. Three real crusts with all the toppings. Fun to make and eat, no need to heat. Pizza? Thanks, Mom. It's so funny, I would love to see what the original label looked like. Cause this is promoting how it has 14 grams of protein. I think if you're like super high uh -huh. or super drunk and you bought a bunch of these it just as kind spot. of, yeah, just to have them. That's true. Right? But like for no reason should you be above age nine and eat this. It's not bad, there's a little, it's just as an adult, I'm like, yeah, I can make better like pizza nachos than these. It's like the pizza crust they use. And it's funny that they do like, because the pepperoni gets heated up, it's greasy. Mm-hmm. Dude, you know what actually might be a really buzzworthy, like buzzy thing? Hmm. Carolina Reaper Lunchables. They have them? No, like if we did that video. Oh yeah. You could pretty much do Carolina Reaper sauce with any Lunchable and that would probably get three. Body of Christ. We place this in my mouth. Uh-huh. Body of Christ? And um, <laughs> definitely greasy, but they're not that bad. Microwaving them? How do you feel about this beer? New Belgian triple Belgian style. Though. Well, first things first, learn how to spell triple, you dumb idiots. I think they spell it Belgian style. Chapel. 8.5% alcohol from Fort Collins, Colorado. I like the 8.5. I'm you know? so sick of Colorado as a state thinking it's so cool. Colorado so is trying, pretty cool, but it does like- trying to be so Colorado. You're right though. I, it is cool, so it's hard for me to like believe that. Right. But you're not wrong because- I love Colorado, but like do, calm down. Dude. Yeah. They're all very Colorado about it. Hey, do you hike a 14er? Shut up. You wanna hike a 14er, dude? Shut up. I think they're single-handedly keeping that little weird business around where you buy those ovals with two letters on them that tell people where you hiked and put a bumper sticker <laughs> on your car. Like, you know that weird business? I saw the first bumper sticker in a long time that I would actually potentially buy and it said 0.0, .0 on it for miles they <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty good. And I was like, I, oh, I, I like it. I've seen that, that's like, pretty good. <laughs> Hope you guys like the new concept. It was fun to do. It was just a fun time. It was fun, we're definitely gonna keep doing it. I like this more I than the brew. So, if you have any suggestions for like snack foods to eat, like maybe you're like, oh, yeah. you guys should get those Dunkaroos. And we're like, of course we're gonna do Dunkaroos eventually. Dunkaroos, bro, maybe they don't make Dunkaroos, do... dog. I'm trying to get some candy cigarettes. Candy dog. cigarettes. So put those suggestions below or send us anything to this 
address, as long as it's not like refrigerated, don't like send us stuff that's gotta be cold, then you do a shitty job of packaging it. Yeah, I like that. I think this is a fun idea. That was fun. Eat it, bitch, it's always good.